So this is just a very quick video to uh, answer a question I saw on the forum. Someone was asking how you could uh, straighten out a uh, row of curved edges. Well, one way you could do this is by using the automatic action center. So I'm just going to demonstrate this. I'm going to activate the scale tool and I've got snapping on just on its default uh, mode. Let me just uh, show you. It's ge geometry set to auto and I'm going to set my action center to automatic. Now this means that I can control the placement and the axis of the action center very precisely. So I'm just going to click on this edge to uh, bring the action center here. And the next thing I'm going to do is use this little blue uh, gizmo here just to snap it to this vertex. And what this has done is that it's aligned my uh, action center to this edge perfectly. You know? I could do it on any edge, it doesn't have to be this one, just whichever edge I click on I could set it and align it, but uh, purposes of this demonstration I'm going to align it to this edge and I'm going to make sure that negative scale is off on my tool handles and what I need to do now is um, these two handles that are not aligned with the edge need just to be zeroed out, so I just drag to zero on the red and then do the same on the green and you can see that it's perfectly flattened out the edges. If I go to the top view, you can see we've got a perfectly straight line. Now, um, you can have even more control than this, and you could even uh, alter the orientation of this while the tool is still active. So if, for instance, I, uh, on the action center properties in the properties toolbar, I click on two handles, I can uh, carry on tweaking. So for instance, I could decide to snap um, my action center to this, to this edge, or I could snap it to this vertex. It's all live, it's all still controllable until I drop the tool. So um, it's just one way of doing it, but uh, I hope you found it useful and thanks very much for watching.